Hey, this is Daniel from Adorama. I'm here at the NAB Show 2017, and we're going to show you all kinds of cool new products. Daniel, I'm here with Bob from Black Magic Design, and we're going to take a look at some cool new stuff here at NAB. So uh, let's start here. And let me uh, know a little bit about this uh, switcher. Sure. So this is the new ATEM Television Studio Pro HD. So what it is, it's a eight input switcher. It's got four HDMI, four SDI, and it's an all-in-one. So you plug it into the back, and you can have the full functionality. It's got picture-in-picture. -picture, it's got an aux bus. You can actually do camera control and control our cameras and, and do color shading. Uh, it, it's amazing. It's got uh, two upstream key or one upstream key and two downstream keys. You got chroma key in this thing. It's just an amazing product for you can do send mixed minuses back. You, I mean, it, it really has a lot. It has two media players to, to uh, key uh, stills uh, for keying, and uh, it's two thousand two hundred ninety-five dollars. We'll start shipping them next month, and uh, it's really just uh, an all-in-one. We had originally introduced uh, about a month ago. Uh, the non-pro version, for lack of a better term, that was a rack-mounted uh, eight-input switcher. This is essentially the same guts, but put into a full control panel. Well, that's great. So you can basically just take this thing and, and set up and, and you know, whatever, plug your monitor in, plug your cameras in, and just start going. Right. So we have a multi-view output, uh, HDMI multi-view. So now I have program preview and all my cameras all lined up, and I can uh, just go. It's great. That looks pretty amazing. We we have a, a, a little live cam, a little live stream studio uh, in our store in New York, and we're always using this. This looks actually, I don't know which one we have there, and I probably shouldn't say, but uh, this looks much fancier. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, I mean, that's the thing. It's it it's as you know, it looks like every other switcher, but uh, it's at a really attractive price point, and it just makes great sense to be able to use something, and it's so compact. I mean, this is really just amazing how we're able to put into uh, such a small package but still have all the features that you're looking for with picture in picture and and uh, you know we're able to mix audio in here and it also has internal storage for the stills so if you load them up before you take it out to a shoot you don't have to hook up a, ca a computer to run it oh that's super useful okay cool and you we're gonna take a look at the new camera as well yeah absolutely so we um, we introduced um, this is the uh, new um, uh, yeah, this is the new Blackmagic Mini Pro 4.6K, and we introduced it about six weeks ago, started shipping it. It has, uh, it was basically, the, the Pro version includes all these external uh, settings, including um, it has ND filters and all this great, uh, you know, touch controls for when you have it on your shoulder, you don't want to have to flip open a, and start touching the touch screen, you can actually do the hardwired uh, switches. But one of the features that we didn't tell everybody when they bought them is that it has Bluetooth connectivity. So now we actually have an app that's going to run on an iPad that you can control the settings of the camera from the iPad app, hooked through Bluetooth. And uh, in addition to the app that we release, we're also going to release the API, which allows people to write their own apps. Because That's very cool. Yeah, so I think that'll give them the flexibility so they can limit what the app does because maybe they don't want it to turn record off and on, but they want to enter metadata, you know, and good scene takes and things like that to the footage as they're shooting. So a special add-on free upgrade that'll happen down the down the road. Well, that's super cool. Now, I don't see I wasn't supposed to ask about this, but what, what's up with this? <laughs> this is a studio viewfinder option. So this, this camera is a very flexible format. You can have a traditional EVF or you can turn it into a studio camera and when you do and you run it through our ATEM switchers you can actually get tally uh, and talk back and uh, it becomes a full studio and you can shade the cameras and uh, so it's a really flexible design. You can shoot movies with it during the day and do a television show at night or, or whatever. We even give you the numbers here to change. Nice, that's super cool. Yeah, I, I really like that as an add-on. The versatility is really important when you're buying a camera, so that gives you that, I guess. Uh, Absolutely. So this camera will do anything. You can shoot a movie with it. You can shoot television shows. You can do anything in between. Um, you can shoot raw if you record raw. Uh, we even have a new option to add an SSD recorder if you want to record data through that. And then, of course, uh, it comes standard with the ability to record an SD card or CFast 2 card. So it really has a lot of flexibility and you can just change. This is even has a quick release. So you can just pull this off quickly and then throw the, uh, the other EVF on and go out into the field and shoot and then come back and turn it back into a studio camera. Oh, that's awesome. Well, thanks for talking to me, uh, Bob. 
Uh, stay tuned at RMTV. We'll have some more videos throughout NAB. And uh, we'll see you later.